If you want to create DVD menus, that is, if you want to export out a footage um, into, um, let's say, for example, for burning in DVD, then you need to go around and make a menu so that there's an interactive DVD menu in the beginning. So for that, you need to go around and add in markers. And specifically, if you want to uh, give uh, the viewers control from their remote then you may want to go around and add in scene markers over here on particular footage so to do that over here you can see that markers is an option and here you can see that menu marker is an option right here so you can go around and add in a menu marker as you can see right here just like this so this is what you have you can go around and set in a menu marker as you like right here so now once you go around onto menu marker, by default, you can see the uh, scene marker as you can see right here. So you can go around and name this out. Let's say, for example, this is the beginning right here, just like this. So let's say this is the beginning scene. So you can go around and add in marker just like that. You can go around over here as well and go around onto markers, onto menu markers right here and set menu marker again. So by default, we are adding the scene marker as you can see and you can go around and name this out. To so let's say for example, I'm going to go around over here and add in this is the middle right here just like this and then i'm going to go around over here onto the third section on the marker and then set the menu marker and let's say this is the climax right here just like this and i'm going to go around over here onto menu marker onto set menu marker right here and then i'm going to go around and set this out as let's say for example end credits right here just like this so once i do that you can see that these are the four markers you can go around and move them out according to how you want and you can also go around and go to the next marker right here just like this to see how it actually looks right here so whenever users click next on their um, a remote right here then what happens is that it It'll go on to these specific scenes right here so you can go around and mark out different part of the movie so that the viewers can navigate around while they're playing this video in a DVD and that is how you can add in a scene marker inside of Adobe Premiere Elements so hope you guys learn something as always and as always please like comment share and subscribe